You probably know that the mussel industry currently gets all its baby mussels or spat from the sea, and there's a couple of problems with that. It differs um, in quantity and quality. You never know when it's coming or when you can get it, so there's no certainty. Spat tends to come at the most inconvenient time. Project's a great thing for New Zealand because mussels are an iconic New Zealand seafood. They're the mainstay of our aquaculture industry. They're a super sustainable industry. And this project really lifts that industry to a whole new level, makes sure it's going to be viable in the future. We're making baby mussels and growing them through and looking after them. So you need to have a caring nature to yourself to, to make sure that they're happy because if they're happy, we're happy. They've definitely grown a lot quicker than the other ones. Look at the difference in uniformity, heaps of variation in those wild ones and the hatchery stuff's really uniform. Hatchery spat's a game changer for our industry. It opens up all sorts of opportunities uh, uh, around selective breeding and developing products. The industry has a growth target of a billion dollars by 2025. So with the Primary Growth Partnership, one of the key intents is that we invest in risky programs that, that companies wouldn't be able to do by themselves because either the, the scale is too large or the, the risk of the science and taking that into a commercial point is too risky. In terms of the, the SPAT NZ program, that risk is definitely looking like it's going to pay off. In terms of dollars, the benefit is huge. We estimate from the current hatchery, when it's fully up and running, $80 million per year. Uh, if you extend that right out through the whole of industry, uh, we're talking up to $200 million a year going into the New Zealand economy. So a tremendous contribution. I'm very proud. It's been a real success story. This is all about doing some great work in the hatchery, producing billions of spat, and then taking them out into the aquaculture world and growing literally the world's best green shell mussels from New Zealand. I think we're awfully proud of what we've achieved in the last few years. Two years ago they were just little tiny sand grains and a handful of tanks back at the hatchery. So it's so gratifying to see them do so well through all the farming stages and be ready for harvest in such a short time. It's still plenty of challenges to overcome, but yeah, a really proud day. <laughs>